right that's it hello everybody hello 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 good to see you hola penny <laughs> <laughs> so it's good to learn sign language, Penny. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it's a, uh, it's a, uh, yeah, it's the first uh, live holistic call in March, and uh, and uh, it will be great to just welcome you, Nikki, Penny, and Sarah or Sas, on these live holistic calls, talking about we will be concentrating on yellow. Uh, so under the umbrella of yellow, there are lots of little areas that we can explore and we can analyze and we can bring uh, lots of um, insights into holistic well-being. Uh, Nikki, you volunteered and you would like to talk about uh, how to overcome depression or uh, sad symptoms. Yeah. Uh, so, so as you have got... Uh, uh, a background in sound healing, so we can see how we can how sound and solar plexus is co are connect. You know how to work with that. Yeah. Yellow, yellow is the color of you know that connects us with the uh, you know the solar plexus. So we'll see how we can activate our power from <laughs> the you know the central power, the core power, and how we can claim more of that power by in a very joyful way. That's uh, that's the. That's what yellow brings in, the vibration of yellow. If you think about it, yellow, uh, when, when you have yellow in your mind, what, you know, what images can you bring in? Sunshine. Sunshine, exactly. So the sun, the, yes, yes. Uh, the sun and, and it, the sunshine is always empowering us, you know, even, mm. if, even if we feel, you know, if you feel very tired, Yes, uh, Penny says spring flowers, the sun. Yes, yeah, so um, if, you, if you feel very tired and you go ahead and you want to have a lot of, when the sun, the sun is out, you can just, okay, I can carry on. And, but if, this, if the sun is on out, it's a bit of a gloomy day and all of that, you know, it makes it really hard to keep going. Can you, you feel very heavy, don't you? Yeah, yeah, very heavy. So yellow is the color, it's called the joy bringer. And also, is it brings you back, you know, like lightness, more light and joy in your life, and that's what we need. And in color mirror system, it's actually yellow is the very first color, the very first bottle. It represents by you know number one bottle is the sun. So so because if we are not in that state of joyful conscious living there's no way we can actually ascend and be better and evolve so we need to come from that space so that's why you know we i believe and also connecting with our solar solar plexus here you know bring more authenticity and <coughs> you know speak your truth yes it is called the i am bottle yes thank yes. you Penny. yes oh jill you're here hello <laughs> It's okay, you're Hi, here now. Fantastic. So, right. Hi, Hi. So, hello. Have you met? Have you met Nikki before and Penny and uh, Sas, Sarah? Yes. I've met you before, Jill. Yeah, yeah. Great. So, yes, you met. You met uh, uh, December the Soul Connections. Uh, yes. Okay. Great. So now we have got the because of some tech, technical issues, we started a bit later. So well, this is the technology is good, but technology can be a little bit <laughs> stressful sometimes. But anyway, I'm keeping light. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are. Yes, ha <laughs> ha. So so there we go. Now, luckily, we've got the chat system and Penny can communicate with us via that. So we're still, we're still together on this. Brilliant. Uh, now, under yellow sunshine, uh, you, we can also see, you know, the, the, the areas that they are actually the positive aspects of yellow. And also we can see the negative, you know, because in everything in life, we've got the good and the bad. Okay. The, the 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 dark and the light or the heavy and the so we can see always the two sides in a coin so with yellow if i could actually ask nikki uh, if there's anything you'd like to contribute in terms of yellow nikki you know what do you think they're like positive sides that you know when you're vibrating and your yellow is really rich and healthy in you 
so what would be the some sort of characteristics what do you think um we're light we're happy we're joyful we're full of laughter we're more positive we want to plan our lives we want to go out there and be active mm -hmm. um we just want to make the most of life yes yes absolutely yes Penny, feel free to co communicate via the chat system if you if you wish. Uh, and when it comes to negative sides, if you if you are not joyful, so what would be the opposite then? You'd be sad, depressed. Yes. Probably want to hide away, stay in, be small. Yeah. Be tearful. Yeah. You, uh, you just don't don't want to embrace life. You just hide away. Okay. Th thank you, Nikki. Well, um, Penny <coughs> says yellow seems to be a color that people either like or don't. It's a color that seems to bring up a reaction. Yeah. Oh. I, agree with that. I got married in yellow. Did oh. you, Jill? Wow. Mm. Fabulous. I've never worn it before. Um, this is many, many years ago, I have to say. I've never well, worn it before. I, wouldn't, I... I couldn't tell, Jill. <laughs> <laughs> You I, I was looking for wedding dresses and I thought I was going to end up with cream or blue or whatever. And I ended up with a kind of primrose yellow. Yeah. And now one of my brand colours, I've worked a lot on my brand colours, is yellow, bright yellow. Fabulous. I, yes. Well, in your case, being, a, being a involved with nutrition and being a factual nutritionist, mm -hmm. you're helping people a lot with their digestive system, right? Yeah. Yeah. So it's it's it just it works perfectly. Yeah. And I'd used purples and blues in my branding before that point. Yeah. Until I did a big exercise with um, some brand experts. And it and Fabulous. when I put my values in and all the thing about my business and what my business stood for and what I stood for, the two colours that came out were a kind of burgundy colour. If you've seen my lifestyle leader um, mm -hmm. tag. And this very bright, vibrant yellow. And I wear it a lot now. I'm sorry I didn't put it on this evening. But I wear it a lot now. Next time, next time, you've got to wear yellow. I Ladies, you've got to wear yellow next time. That's it. <laughs> You're wearing Sarah. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> I'm wearing yellow. Brilliant, brilliant. Okay, so uh, now it's, it's actually very interesting because uh, your violet or purpley color is the complementary color. No, they, Penny, you actually you said at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> so you picked up your, or whoever, you know, chose to choose yellow and, and violety purple colors for your branding, Jill, uh, very mm. wisely, probably whether they consciously or consciously, they went for that combination. But in color mirror system, they are complementary colors. Okay. Um, if you have the wheel of colors, you will see they actually like opposite each other, but it means that they are complementing each other. Yeah. Right, so we can either go through either a yellow meditation, if you feel like it, or you can have an open conversation about yellow, uh, as it is. Uh, or if Jill is prepared to talk about uh, vitamin D, we can talk about vitamin D. It doesn't have to be today. It can be on another call in March because that comes under the umbrella of, of uh, the topic yellow, sunshine, joyful power. Uh, so what would that be? What would you prefer of all of this? I don't, I don't know whether we can fit all, all of this in within the call. That's why I am. Um, pardon? I'd quite like a, a, med, a meditation. That yeah, would be good. Okay. Fantastic. Yeah. Brilliant. Right. Are you? Are you <laughs> yes. Now, those of you who have all got the uh, yellow angel, uh, this picture, you know, it's, it's, a, it's, the, it's the angel of joy and wisdom. So please do spray a little bit and just connect with the yellow angel. Uh, I've already sprayed the room here, and so you know I'm sending a vibration out there to all of you who are connecting on the call, and also the people that will be watching back again. So I will I will spray a little bit more up here like that. So uh, just to reactivate it, brilliant. What does it smell, what does it smell of that? Uh, very lemony and great. It's like a lemon and grapefruit combination. Like grapefruit and lemon, remind yeah. me. Yes. So, right. So, let me just start then. We're going to start with uh, just setting, setting the right space for you. So, just 
make sure that you sit comfortably your 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 feet are touching the ground and you know like uh, your your shoulders are relaxed okay now close your eyes take a deep breath it is the time to be with your body for a moment. We lead such, you know, stressful and hectic lifestyles. Is this the time just for you? Feel where you are in your body, where you possibly hold some tension. Just go through and feel, is it, is it your back? Is it your shoulders? Is there anywhere on your, on your face? Just release the tension as much as you can and let go take a deep breath let the relaxation start at the top of your crown and gently wash down like warm gentle energy relaxing your forehead relaxing your eyelids your cheeks and your jaw. Relax the back of your head, your neck and your throat. Relax your shoulders. Breathe into them and put down the burdens of the, of the day. Put down the world outside. This is your time for your own healing. Really relax your shoulders. Relax your arms, your elbows, and your hands. Relax the muscles down your spine. Relax your chest. Let your breath come easily and gently. Relax your stomach muscles. Relax into your hips. Relax your thighs, your knees, your calves. Relax your ankles and your feet. Let the relaxation wash down like warm, gentle energy, washing out every last bit of tension, out through the soles of your feet and into the earth where it is transformed. Now, find yourself in a yellow room. Yellow walls, yellow floor, ceiling and windows in the center of the room is a yellow chair go and sit on the yellow chair and begin to feel how it feels in this yellow space how does it feel to breathe it in how does it feel on your skin where in your body do you feel it allow the yellow light into your base chakra at the tip of your spine. How does it feel when this bright ray of sunlight begins to blend with the red? Can you really let this much light into all your survival fears? Can it really just be a bit of a giggle? Move the yellow to the sacral chakra now. And let the yellow blend with the orange. Feel how light this energy center becomes when the yellow power mixes with your creativity. Move the yellow now to your solar plexus and let the yellow light be amplified and expanded. Feel the power expanding. Feel the joy, feel the laughter of the universe. Life was meant to be light. Allow your body to relax into that thought and keep breathing it in until there is no more contraction in your solar plexus. Until all you feel is light and laughter and joy. Now, move the yellow into your heart. Allow the sunlight 
into all the old painful places in your heart. And as the light shines into your heart, you feel your heart expanding with joy. Move the yellow now into your throat and feel all the bright light shining on everything you need to say. This is how you can actually support your throat to speak your truth. And when you do that, it comes out with so much light and joy. Move the yellow into your third eye now and feel this ray of sunlight into that energy center, activating your ability to see clearly, activating your ability to think with clarity. Hold this light there while it brings the two brain hemispheres together, letting your intuition and your intellect work together. What a beautiful combination. Now it's time to move the yellow to your crown and feel how brightly the light begins to shine above your crown. The yellow creates a huge light above your crown like a halo and then cascades down around you in beautiful rainbow light. Oh, what a blissful thing to be in. Hold that energy until you feel complete with it. Just allow another minute or so to feel immersed in that beautiful rainbow light, surrounded by beautiful sunlight. Feel the sunlight in all parts of your body. Feel the warmth. Feel the expansion, feel the joy, feel relaxed and blessed being such beautiful sunlight. When you're ready, come back on with us. Hmm. <laughs> oh, it was good just to see the cat being part of it as well. <laughs> she loves to join in. <laughs> Yellow on the go. <laughs> oh. oh, my eyes closed. I couldn't see the cat. Oh, no. <laughs> Here she oh. Just leave you alone for a minute, do you? Oh. oh well, how was it for you? How was it? How was now? Because now we moved into yellow. Before last month it was orange. Now it's yellow. Now some people love it, some people don't. How was it for you, Sas? Was it was it joyful? It was um it, it was great clarity actually. I, I felt um I could see with great clarity. Um, the light coming through all the different chakras, mm. uh, through all the different energy centers, and I thought that's what represented to me clarity, confidence, mm -hmm. uh, and courage as well. Mm. Even if you say cowardly custard, <laughs> <laughs> but actually, it's when you're lacking that color, I think, that or lacking the yellow vibration, mm. that maybe mm. you're not as confident. Um, so yes, that was mm -hmm. confident. So it felt um, very uplifting mm -hmm. uh, and very light. Yes. So yes. I could I could really visualise the colour, especially coming in through the crown and bathing me in beautiful bright sunshine. Mm. So orange was is a bit more earthy. I find a bit more um, a bit more sort of connected to the earth, whereas yellow is starting to move up into a higher vibration and yeah. Yes. Connect my emotions as well. So I felt really light and joyous. <laughs> it was not a little bit. Brilliant. Brilliant. Oh. Well, uh, let me just share something from Penny as well. Uh, 
she said the stronger connection for her was with the third iron crown. She felt as if wearing something on her head. And uh, the meditation made her feel lighter and energized. Okay, brilliant. Yes. Yeah, so, <laughs> yeah. So, so the connection was with the third eye and the crown. Okay, right. Yeah. So it's, uh, it's, um, it's actually, it's actually uh, interesting to know that, you know, yellow, inter when it comes to uh, stressful situations or you're sitting exams or if you have, you know, somebody that they, they, they have to concentrate a lot, they need to, you know, or if you, if you feel confused and you don't know what to say or what to write or whatever, yellow, you know, if you have yellow flowers, let's say, at your table near your desk, that, that will really bring that, you know, you bring that concentration back as an easy option. You know, if amazing. My, my youngest daughter is at Durham University and she's busy writing English essays. Yeah. And she sits with daffodils on her desk. Oh, beautiful. Yes, yes. Yeah, Penny says uh, her room is actually Penny Yellow, her, her, her office here. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can see that. Yeah, yeah. Yay, yay. And Nikki, anything from you? How was your, the experience, the med uh, meditation in Yellow? I loved it, but I feel zapped. <laughs> 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 it was, um, I felt very safe um, and connected to everything. Mm -hmm. uh, and the head one was really good matching what I clear seeing and then the mind and getting the mind to um, like absorb the yellow mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah I like that to, to help me think more clearly really yeah yeah uh, and how can you translate or analyze in your own you know how it feels to you when you say zapped so how, how does that feel to you it was good zapped today um, <laughs> okay. it was like a, it was like an infusion um running through all my veins and down my spine i feel like tingly and like the sunshine's in me now oh. rather than being out of me it's in me Beautiful sensation. Yay. Yeah, it's really good. Yay. Fantastic. Well, we have five minutes left before the end of the call. Uh, now, uh, I, would love, I would love to organize us, you know, what we're going to do in the next couple of weeks. And next Monday, if I, if I understood right, Nikki, you won't be able to be on the call. I won't be here next Monday, no. But will I you be okay? Sorry, sir. Sorry? Me neither. I'm going to Australia. I should be flying in the air this time next week. Oh, but, oh I know. You're going to have a fantastic time okay, with your... You're going to meet your daughter, right? Yes, yeah. Yes. Long time to see. <laughs> brilliant, brilliant. Well, when you, come back, there, I'd imagine. when you come back, uh, you know, it'd be great to hear your, your stories and, you know, your experiences. It would be great to have you back. Yeah, I know. I'd, I'd love to. Yeah. So... Okay, Nikki, then in that case, we can, uh, if you'd like to talk about, your, from your experience about yellow and help you with overcoming sad uh, and uh, depression, will it be okay to be on, on the 28th of March? Will be able to join us then? I think so. That's Easter Monday, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. I think because, I... because we already, have already missed a call in March, I don't want to miss another call. So mm -hmm. I'm going to leave it open and if, okay. if, I, if I know you're going to come along then I will share with everybody that that's going to be the topic uh, okay it should be yeah. okay okay all right brilliant fantastic so Jill will you be able to share about uh, vitamin D and sunshine because there's there's a little bit of confusion about sunshine or being good for us and you know bringing cancer and all of that however I, they, I don't know whether I sent you an article about you know the actual how in, in how good it is to have vitamin D in our lives for various reasons, and that prevents even cancer. Yeah. Uh, it has shown, you know, scientifically speaking. Now, so what I'm trying to do here with your support, all of you, you know, holistic educators, uh, bringing science and spirituality together. You know, bringing yeah. how we can, you know, bring these two areas together. Um, so, so it's a it's 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 not just you know okay you know we're up here and connecting with uh, with with God or higher 
consciousness high or whatever that is, but also how we can see in a very grounded way what's the best way to be holistically, you know, alert and holistically vibrant. Uh, not only in one, that's, what, that's my intention behind these calls. Uh, that's the 21st for me then. Next Monday, brilliant. Yeah. Brilliant, fantastic. Penny, will you be able to join us next Monday? Will you be able to share something? Because we have also, um, in, as part of the color mirror system, the, uh, the spiritual principles and that associated with yellow is claiming your authentic power. Would you like to share something for, uh, on, that, on that topic? Penny? I will be here, not sure. Yes, I was waiting for you to come back. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, okay. Well, it's a, it's a derivative, isn't it? There's different shades of, of, of yellow. Gold is one of them. Yes, yes. Well, higher vibration, we, are, we are going to move into gold very naturally. So, so we can actually start with talking about it, if you like, Penny, next week. And then we can mention that, you know, this is something we can, you know, analyze more when the gold comes because we have so much to talk about gold as well. <laughs> Me, the golden muse. <laughs> okay. So, um, Sas, I would love you to, when you come back from Australia, to talk about, uh, you know, sound healing and, you know, with bring, well, bring, bring that and then maybe even take us on a sound meditation. Be, yeah, be maybe fun. just before we go, there is a sound which is the vibration of, of the yellow color, okay. which is the plexus, which is literally the, the, the vowel sound O H, which literally translates as O. So if you, you can just sound that. It literally by holding your hand on your solar plexus and just sounding that O sound. Uh -huh. it, of three or four times it actually gives you an energy of protection around you um, of brightness and lightness and it also moves any stuck emotions that are hanging around there that may be on top of the most positive so yeah. it's to heighten the vi emotional vibration it's a good sound the O sound fabulous fabulous O sound okay o. yes yeah well, that try that together